All right, guys, so here is an exclusive look at the flannel that we will be dropping. This is the one that everybody has been waiting for. Let me take it off and show you guys real quickly. Okay, so here it is right here. You guys seen it in a ton of photos on my Instagram and whatnot. This is coming out sooner than you guys think. It is the perfect, trust me, perfect flannel to have in your wardrobe. Crazy, crazy quality. Um, I just wanted to let you guys know right here, exclusive announcement. Stay tuned. Make sure you guys follow the Instagram right here, Richie Lee Collection. We will be dropping these in the next drop very, very soon. Okay guys, so I just got a pair of Uniqlo raw selvage denim right here. This is actually a pair of denim that I've recommended throughout the years and I realized I don't even have a pair myself right now. So I just got these from the mall. These are only 49 bucks. When it comes to raw selvage denim, these could go up to like three to $400 when it comes to other brands like APC and Nudie and whatnot. But for 49 bucks, if you guys are just starting off, this is definitely the way to go. I do plan on giving these some wear and tear and hopefully, you know, developing some whiskers and whatnot. But yeah, let me get these tried on right now so you guys can see the fit and I'll talk a little bit about the quality. Give me one second. All right, guys, so I just got on uh, the pair of denim right here. I'm actually gonna go and say these fit way better than I remembered. I had these a few years ago and I would go and say these are super comfortable, not too skinny, not too baggy. These are a 32, 32 and uh, yeah, man, they're actually a lot better than I remember. The one thing that does scare me though is the bleeding, you know, with raw selvage denim, it is not washed yet. So there's gonna be a lot of ink in this uh, fabric and I am pretty afraid that they are gonna bleed all over my sneakers So it's just one thing that you got to expect with these kind of giving me the Travis Scott vibes a little bit for 49 bucks Do not sleep Uniqlo. These are definitely a really good purchase. All right guys So here's like a POV shot of the denim right here and one thing to keep in mind Uniqlo actually offers free hemming on their denim so if they are too long you guys can get them hemmed in store like i said these are 32 32 and they fit really nice nice stacks at the bottom right here might be a pair of denim that i'm wearing really frequently really like these All right, guys, so comments on comments. We used to do this all the time where I react to the comments that have the most likes on the channel. I'm gonna be steamrolling through these. I don't wanna spend too much time on each one, five of them, all right? Let's get into the first one. All right, so number one, we got Edward Rivera. Honestly, shout out to Rich and Tan. This is the reason I've been subbed to the channel for three years. No pretentious fashion high horse, just everyday clothing tips with some entertainment. You know, when it comes to fashion, I feel like it's supposed to be fun, something lighthearted. I feel like there's so many youtubers out there that just take it like ultra serious and they're sitting by themselves in a room real analytical about it no laughs no jokes and i don't think that's how it's supposed to be so you know that's why we joke a lot we're always poking fun at each other and clowning on each other because at the end of the day it's not that serious so yeah i'm glad that you guys saw that and uh it's really appreciated number two oh my from high flashy 500 plus ups on this one pov you are waiting for the minimal story all right guys listen there's a lot surrounding this story right here. It's not something I could just throw out there. I understand the video got way more than 8,000 likes. I appreciate it, but trust me, it is coming. I just got to work around some things. You know, I signed some forms, but when it comes, it's going to be crazy. You want to look at... Well, let's move on to the next comment. All right, so number three, Swiss Curry. Richie's starting to look like Rochelle Lee with that... Oh, my... Oh! Can't even finish this one. He said, I'm starting to look like Rochelle Lee with the hair and 400 plus people liked it. What? The? Listen, when it comes to the hair, I got a plan. All right, the plan gonna, gonna be crazy. The plan is gonna be something they don't even understand. Just kidding. I don't, I actually don't have a plan. Bruh. I'm just seeing where things go. I don't want to cut it because I try this every single year, guys. I see a lot of people giving me support saying just, you know, grow it out for a few more months. I see people also saying cut it. I don't know myself. You know, COVID got us all a little wacky. Let let me know. What you, I mean, don't call me Russia. Whoa, whoa. Even worse was Rachel. When you guys call me right. Oh my God. That disrespect was crazy on that one. Shout out to Swiss Curry. It's all in good fun. All right. So number four from Juniper. We need more outfit battles and rate that 
fits. I'm glad you asked. That is actually a Hype Talk segment. I didn't want to, you know, throw it out in the house of hype or anything. I think it fits with Hype Talk alone. So we are going to be doing that very soon. As soon as the sets are done, we are working on them right now. We're kind of like in a transition phase. As you can see, we've been filming here for all the videos. But trust me, the new sets are going to be insane. The new house, it's all in the works right now. So yeah, to answer your question, outfit battles and rate that fits will be coming very soon with Hype Talk. I can't wait to get back on set with those guys and just start clowning again but yeah it's coming soon we you know we're working on it all right so number five we got daily dosage baron two weeks ago take a shot every time tan says at the end of the day sure. so at the end of the day That's but so in nice. the day at the end of the day all right guys thank you for checking out that rapid fire round comments on comments let me know if you guys want me to do more of these and respond to your guys's most up comments we do read them i do see them trust me and they are hilarious uh we used to do them with tan and johnny all the time trust me one of if you if you are, are let me say this if you are a real one you guys know about do your thing hang low do it wobble to the floor do it show. what <laughs> Woo! let me know if you guys know what i'm talking about all right peace What's going on, everybody? I got to give a huge shout out to today's sponsor, Skillshare. Obviously, we brought them up a lot in the past, but I'm really excited to be partnering with Skillshare due to how much value it could add to your guys' life. If you guys are looking to learn a new skill or take on a new hobby, Skillshare is your answer. No longer do you got to, you know, sign up for your local community college class and be around a bunch of people. No, you could take Skillshare courses in the comfort of your own home. I really like it for myself because recently I've been listening to a lot of like self-help podcasts, but then it stops right there. But with Skillshare, you actually get graded on completing your tasks, which really makes you apply what you actually learn. One class that I saw that was really recommended by a lot of people was discovering success seven exercises to unlock your purpose passion and path by emma gannon there's just a ton of classes out there there's even a class by jeff staple you could even learn how to paint uh photography entrepreneurship possibilities are endless so make sure you guys hit that link in the description box below the first thousand people to do so will get a free trial to their premium membership which is crazy all right trust me guys it's going to be super useful a nice way to stay productive during these times. Peace. Okay guys, so I'm just checking out a brand new fresh Carhartt jacket right here, fresh from the store. It is Super like- fresh. I mean, this is like first day on the job fresh. Pretty much pitch black, you know what I mean? Um, this is what you might wanna look out for when it comes to a vintage uh, Carhartt jacket right here. Just look at the frayed edges. This is definitely the most natural looking you wanted to get. But I really like it on the pockets yeah. too as well. Um, someone was telling me it is pretty hard to get the tonal colors with the uh, jacket. So an alternative is pretty much finding one with a really, really worn down collar because it's going to be kind of, you know, similar. I mean, no one can really tell that this started off with two different colors. Exactly, exactly. So huge shout out to Damage Glitter for hooking this jacket up right here. This is a size medium, but like, uh, you know, any other vintage piece, it shrunk throughout the years. It's kind Kind of like a small medium very fitted huge huge shout out to him also if you guys are interested in learning more about work work clothing we dropped the crazy crazy video last friday we'll leave the link in the description box below for you guys make sure you guys check that video out if you guys missed it all right guys so you know one of the most important uh, roles that they assigned me in the office is to uh refill it up with snacks and drinks right? so this is what we're here to do we're gonna pick some uh, energy drinks all right all right, let's see. Gotta see low the Red Bull, man. Obviously, we're running low. Sugar free? Sugar free only, okay? The zero, oh. get this one stuck. I'm usually with Team Red Bull. It's usually with Team Red Bull. I know Monster. What about Bang? Let's get one Bang. Let's get one Bang. Ooh, peach mango. I think that's enough caffeine for a couple of hours. Let's get some waters, though. All right, all right. We gotta stop buying uh, bottled waters, okay? Go yeah. green. Green more. That's the goal for 2021, is go green more. A long time since your boy had an ice cream sandwich. Ice cream sandwich, man. That, that's my top three. Y'all know the deal. You know where we're at. It's lunchtime right now. So we're at the mall food court. I feel the cheesesteak and Pan Express, baby. Look, man, I don't be vlogging all the clean stuff I eat. Would you guys rather watch me eat like a cold chicken breast or a nice juicy cheesesteak? Look at that. Look at that.